Well, let's talk about the U.S. government of 1938. And the burgeoning new industry they didn't regulate. They said it makes no sense, they're just dispensing nutrients, my dear. And if we pop that bottle top, we know what we would hear. I am not a medicine, I am not a drug. Dude, I'm food, so don't intrude, it's rude to pull my plug. I wanna be a mystery, don't peer inside the pill. And if I'm not a medicine, perhaps you never will. In 1938, a new US law requires all pharmaceutical drugs to be tested for safety. But vitamins escape this regulation, opening the door for the industry to expand. And by the 1970s, the industry is booming. The FDA, concerned about high-dose vitamins, tries to tighten the rules, but fails. They try again in the 90s. This time, they want better labeling and to remove unsafe products. But the industry fights back, claiming the regulation will make it too expensive and limit consumer choice. You know I wear my therapeutic promises with pride. With every name, a happy claim, discreetly qualified. No reason to investigate, no reason to delay. You might just live forever if you take me twice a day. Oh, but I am not a medicine, I am not a drug. To keep me cheap, you need to sweep me right under the rug. Hey, FDA, get out the way, why can't we stay? I am not a medicine And ignorance is bliss In 1994, a new U.S. law is passed forbidding the testing of dietary supplements for safety or effectiveness before sale. 